There is YouTube drama in the air. Now before I continue, I want to let it be known that I do not know every fucking detail about this story. I'm just pretty much giving my input on what I know so far. I'm not going to watch every fucking video that people have made about this. Um, I've watched about half of the Bad Kid show. And, you know, I'm, pretty, I'm ready to lay down my... Uh, Side, not my side of the story, but how I feel about this uh, topic. And if you don't know by now, I'm talking about the whole Raw Instinct T. Martin dilemma. Um, I'm going to start by saying I've never seen a Raw Instinct video. I am subscribed to T. Martin, and um, I have ultimate respect for the guy. But I've never seen a Raw Instinct video. Now... That you don't know what the dilemma is about. T. Martin is accusing Raw Instinct of stealing his video ideas and some of his videos and his thumbnails and tags and stuff like that. Now, I'm I can like I'm kind of on both sides here. I'm neutral. I'm not picking a side here, and I can see where both guys. I can see both of their um, sides of the story. I agree with both of them. Like Raw Instinct's thumbnails are really really similar to T. Martin's. Now that I would consider to be not like you know kind of copying, I would consider that copying. I would if someone like copied thumbnails, make them look pretty much identical to mine. I would confront them about it and be like, yeah, you know, you need to change up your thumbnails. Maybe they look a lot like mine. And um, also, Ron Singh used to put T Martin in the tags, and uh, also that is you know pretty much another thing. T. Martin confronted Ron Singh said that he didn't want his name to be in the text. Now, there's, like, again, two sides to this. Ron Singh sort of, it was a way of him giving, not like an homage, but, you know, showing them that, you know, my videos are like T. Martin's, I'll put his name in the text, so maybe, you know. But then another way, if someone's searching for T. Martin and they find Raw Instinct's videos, that's driving them away from T. Martin and giving Raw Instinct the you know that person if someone is not subscribed to raw instinct or not subscribed to t martin and they are searching for tips and tricks and they come across they search t martin because they hear about t martin from a friend they search t martin but then they see a specific trick that they want to find out or a specific tip that they want to find out that raw instinct did a video on and because raw instinct has t martin in the tags his video results will pop up and so i mean it's really a touchy subject. I can't. I'm not gonna pick sides. I'm on. I'm neutral here. But uh, I'm saying like both of them. Really, what they need to do. I. I'm saying this with the most respect possible. They need to just let it go. I mean, they like. It's probably already over with. I don't even know. I'm not up to date on the whole YouTube drama thing. So it's probably already over with. I'm probably late on the upload. But I don't really care. I need to. I just wanted to get my opinion out there. They need to just let it go. You know, Team Art, you do you. Instinct, you do you. If you don't like each other, don't talk to each other. Don't bash each other. You guys obviously can't bash each other because you're both machinima directors and one of you get, will get booted. But just, you know, if you, do, if you guys don't like each other, you don't like your videos, then don't talk to each other. I mean, it's practically impossible to come up with an original video idea. I, I've stolen some ideas, like live commentaries. Think of the first person who ever did live commentary. I don't even know who the first person who did live commentary was. Now everybody's doing live commentaries. There is, like, it is not a crime to copy someone's idea of, like, a video. Like, I mean, if someone, like, word for word, like, use the same phrases, use, like, the same, like, someone, say, uh, it was, like, a tips and trick video on how to get a Moab. And someone did it on the exact same app. Like, say I did a tip and trick video how to get a Moab. I did it on uh, C Town with an ACR suppressed. If someone did the same tips and trick video on how to get a Moab on C Town with an ACR suppressed using the same tips that I used, I would consider that copying my video. But I, I've never seen a Raw Instinct video, so I can't really say that he's copying T Martin, like his uh, things. But I mean, he does have the right to give his audience. The tips and tricks that he's found out, whether he got them from T Mart or not. And the same thing goes with T Martin. If Raw Instinct put up a tips and trick video, he has the right to 
um, put that to his audience and make a video about that so his audience will know about it. But, you know, it's just, it's touchy. I mean, but really, all this is insignificant because at the end of the day, both of you guys are getting paid. Both of you are getting paid. Instinct's getting paid. Team Mark's getting paid. You guys are successful, and that's pretty much all that matters. If you guys are, su are successful, keep doing you. That's all that matters right now. I mean, like like I said, I mean, it's just impossible to come up with a ri with an original idea. Everybody, at some point or another, has stolen an idea from another commentator. But that's just how it is. So, you know, hopefully this all blows over. Hopefully nobody, you know, will make it more worse than already is. I don't even know if this drama is still going on. So if it is and I upload this late, or if it isn't and I upload this late, oh well, fuck it. But yeah, that's pretty much my uh, input on this. If you guys enjoyed it, give it a thumbs up. If you did not enjoy it, give it a thumbs down. I honestly don't care. And I will see you guys later. Peace.